Hey, 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 y'all. Welcome to the channel. For those of you that are new, welcome to Birth and Bosses with Felicia. I am Boss Lady for you guys. I hope you're having a great day, guys. I'm having a great day. It is raining, raining, raining in my neck of the woods, guys. But I am out here in the streets, not shopping. Well, I am shopping, getting ready to shop, but grocery shop, okay? I'm not out here shopping for... um gift baskets today so i wanted to bring y'all guys along with me on my little shopping um video shopping haul i am actually um going to the grocery store for somebody else but for myself as well um some of my um spiritual children from church um they're cooking tacos and i have had the taste for tacos for a couple of weeks now Probably about a month now and I just haven't taken the time to um, fix them you know since my husband passed I don't do a lot of cooking like that well he was my motivation to cook I don't do a lot of cooking because I don't eat a lot of regular food <laughs> regular foods that most people eat um so I don't do a lot of cooking per se of you know like normal tacos stuff like that I don't um, do it if I do cook stuff like that it's always an altered version um, for myself okay um, those of you that have been following me know and if you haven't been following me um, I've lost almost 100 pounds naturally and I've kept it off for six maybe this year the ending of this year will be set yeah the ending of this year will make seven years so I've kept it off my weight has been consistent I could stand to lose a few more pounds, but nevertheless, I'm excited about the journey that I not only um, tackled, but I was very successful in it. Um, there's not many people that you hear of losing weight and they keep it off. And I have consistently kept my weight off for the entire time. So what turned out, what started out as a journey turned into a lifestyle or lifestyle change. Um, so I am going to Aldi's to pick up the items um, for them. Um, one thing, um, when they shop, they do not know how to shop, okay? My, I tell my own son that. They spend absolutely too much money shopping, and I'm like, y'all don't be going to the right stores. They know me. I'm going to save a dime. I'm going to save a penny. I'm going to save a dollar wherever I can. So most of the items that they need are really cheap at Aldi's, okay? I normally don't buy meat from Aldi's unless I'm buying some, um, unless I'm buying a salmon. If it's not a salmon, I normally don't buy. I want them to, I want them to slow this car down um, before they hit me, okay? And it's not gonna be good if I can get out of the car. <laughs> but um yeah um that's the only meat i normally get from here so we're gonna get the meat from another local supermarket but we are going in here to see if we can get our fruits and vegetables guys if you have aldi's or aldi's depending on how you pronounce it y'all know i'm a country girl um if y'all have an aldi's in your city um, really, really great place to buy healthy and um, foods that you don't find. So I'm going to show y'all my alternative to eating tacos. Stay okay, y'all. So like I said, it's raining. But y'all know I am not an umbrella type of girl. Even though I got my hair out, I still don't have an umbrella. Got one right in the car. But the first thing you need to do when you come to Aldis is have you 25 cents ready, okay? Because you have to put a quarter in the cart and I pour it in. Sometimes you can look up and people will have a cart sitting out and you don't have to put your quarter in. But that's not the case today. So y'all, let's go inside of house. Okay, y'all, so I'm going to put my First thing we gotta get is 
the um, lettuce, so we're gonna get shredded lettuce, and we're gonna get, um, I guess, probably what, three packs of these. So there's one, and they are $1.89 for a eight ounce bag. And of course, it's cheaper to put the lettuce in yourself, but we don't have time for that, y'all. So let's do that. So, okay, we got the lettuce. And I'm probably going to have to cut my phone off so I can look back at the list to see what it is I'm supposed to be getting. I can remember some of the items, but not all. Okay. So, so let's go back this way. Let's get some tomatoes. Um, waiting for them to move. I will come, we'll come back, we'll come back, we'll come back. So let's go this way. It's taking them too long. So we're going to go this way. We're not going to be in here long at all. Excuse me. All right, so let's get them some salsa con queso. This is what I use. So we're gonna get two of those. All right, we got two of those. They are one eighty-nine, and we're gonna get chunky salsa. Let's get um, medium. That is two nineteen. So we're gonna get two of those. Let's get a medium and let's get a mild. All right, so they use regular tortilla chips. So we're gonna go ahead and pick those up for them. Let's see what we got. Restaurant style. They have, which are 185. Then they have the Big Dippers, which are 198. Let's get one of those. Let's get the tortilla rounds. Those are one ninety five. They asked for three bags of chips, so I'm gonna get two of one kind and one of the other kind. So let's do two of the big dippers. Okay. We're gonna do two of the big dippers and one. I'm going to get them all just to like, okay? Let's just get them, Let's get them all just to like. So we got three of those. I'm trying to think, should I get another cheese, y'all? What y'all think? Maybe we should get, um, get one more cheese, maybe. All right, let's get one more. All right. the benefit will come in here. The items are much cheaper, so where you probably would be spending four or five dollars at one store, it's much cheaper here. And let's see, these are the alternative chips that I use, which are cauliflower chips. We're gonna get those, and I'm gonna get two bags, so I can use one for my nachos, and then I'll just have one to go um, in the cabinet. Y'all, I actually love these veggie straws. They are not as healthy for you as people think they are. They're a little bit better than using regular chips, but they still not all that great. But I love them. I don't eat them that often. Okay, I know we're supposed to get sour cream, so let's get that now. Let's see, sour cream, sour cream. Sour cream is $1.69. Mine for home. I gotta stick it to the side. 
Okay, taco season, and I know they told me to get shredded cheese. Okay, so let's get the shredded cheese. I'm going to get, um, I forgot what kind they told me to get, but let's get, maybe we'll get the taco style. Let me check my list, y'all. Right. So I normally don't buy hamburger and meats from here, like I said, unless it's the salmon. Let's look at the salmon real quick, y'all. It's running like $20 dollars. And they have one. Oh, okay, okay. Y'all see the worker here trying to take down? I'm just messing. But I got them for $28 and $25 for the salmon. But, um, yeah, that's 28 and 25 and thank God he didn't um, hit me because he didn't act like he was so remorseful for dropping that stuff on me, but I can promise you that I wouldn't have had a lawsuit down here at Aldi's, okay? But anyway, um, he was like, excuse me, and I got out, like, okay. <laughs> but he had some frozen hard items that almost hit me in the head. But anyway, I did get the hamburger from here because it's the same price um, at the local grocery store, maybe about 20 cents cheaper. So I just went ahead and um, got it from here so that I don't have to make it one stop, okay? So the next thing we need to get, let me grab me some sparkling waters while I, oh, watermelon, y'all. I've never had watermelon sparkling water. They are 69 cents. So I'm gonna grab me a couple of those. Um, some of the smoothies from church actually just bought me some of these, but um, I've never had I've had cherry limeade, but I've never had watermelon. So we're gonna try those two flavors. All right, if you are new following me, the only thing I drink is water. Sometimes instead of just plain water, I drink sparkling water, but I try not to drink too much of that either. Um, so yeah have some of those put so I can put a couple up. The only other things I need to get is the tomatoes, the taco seasoning, and black olives, okay? Let's pray that we can find all of those items in here so that I do not have to go to another store, okay? The only thing that may be an issue is going to be the olives, okay? So they have the taco seasoning mix. We're gonna get uh, we're gonna get two packs of those, okay? We don't want it to be too salty. So we're gonna do two packs of those and um let's go get the tomatoes and let's go get the olives. Where the olives would be in here, I have absolutely no idea, but we're gonna find out, okay y'all? Excuse me. We're gonna find out where they are. Hopefully they are not too far. Be notified. Get your money, honey, and fill your bag to the next video. Bye, y'all.